Yeah. It's Poncho, and let's open today's new music releases. Seems like it's winter already because everyone's inside making art tonight. We have some artists that gave us some shock drops, uh, collaborations we would have never thought of, and the list keeps going on. This has to be some of the most exciting musics we've seen in a very long time in regards to the variety we're seeing tonight. So, of course, we'll be getting into the singles first, and then we'll dive into the albums, mixtapes, and etc. Since the last video upload, these artists dropped during the week, starting off with I Am Sue uploading a legend, which truthfully, he is, in my opinion, Big Boogie, featuring 42 Doug and YTB Fat, Pool Party, Lil Kaylee featuring Stunna Gambino, and Sus FBI Remix. Troy are publishing new music yet again this week. Honestly, just expect him to drop like two to three songs a week. Dude is unstoppable right now. And actually, that brings us to the name of his new song, Can't Be Stopped. And an album that randomly came out during the week is I Am Dot Taylor, a gangsta grills project by DJ Drama and featuring M. Dot Taylor. Singles that drop this week starts off with Troy Ave giving us his second record of the week called More Blood Money, a wild collaboration we would have never expected with a, a hip hop artist and a country artist. It's actually off of Jelly Roll's new album, Beautifully Broken, Picking Up the Pieces. He has a new song with Russ called Really Gone and another song with Wiz Khalifa, Higher Than Heaven. Hmm. Makes sense. J.O. featuring Popcon, hmm, Pressa featuring Tall Up Twins and Tim Neat pieces. MJ Grizz featuring Tory Lanez Vibes, Dom Kennedy, Class of 95, Lil Dirk, man, what? Featuring Huncho, Late Checkout, Flea, Big Dog, Stun Again, Bino, Kairos, Interlude, Cowboy, Dying to See, Skepta featuring Flo Millie, Wiley, Cordae Mattis. <laughs> Side note, I heard this song while I'm making this video and Cordae's come back like, like he got a chip on his shoulder or something. Dude came in with heat. Like, Corday, we like you. You go hard. Trigger 500K featuring 42 Doug. Last one's left. Tenny featuring Friday. Malakia remix. J. Geek featuring Scarlet. Go crazy. Puya live and let die. Shorty Shorty selling Kane. Kalora featuring Scory. Bankroll. Josiah, no religion. Eric Bellinger featuring Conscience. Special Uncle Waffles. Featuring Joey Bat and Royal Music, Water Bus, Amir OB is back again. Man, he's this is on a fire run here with the new record called Crash, Baby Tron, Really Jimmy. And he actually samples something off of The Walking Dead in this record. Moving all the way to Dreamville, we're gonna start off with Earth Gang featuring Village Village and T Pain, Love You More. And last but not least, the biggest single of the week here is by J. Cole, Port Antonio, and his only release on IG. He kind of addresses basically everything. And uh, you know what? There is going to be a lot of crazy, a lot of crazy music coming from it. We can tell that already. Now it's time for the albums. And there's a lot of exciting ones that dropped tonight. Like we're going to start off with my, with my personal favorite. All right. Dej Loaf is back, baby. <laughs> Woo. That's what I'm talking about. She ended up publishing end of summer and her new album holds 14 songs lasting a total of 42 minutes long, roughly. And really one of the most beautiful things about this album is you hear so much evolution going on. Like you hear a lot of new Dej sound, but she actually kind of incorporated some like older sounding vibes and uh, gosh, if you know, you know, right? Five out of five Dej, we love it. Next up, we got Big X to plug uploading Take Care and that album is about 31 minutes long, having 15 songs. Rich Forever 5 is now uploaded on streaming platforms and this piece of work has 16 songs being 37 minutes long. It's actually one of their most unique projects, at least in my opinion, in my mind, because uh, we do get a lot of new music from them, but you can tell they also added some like older music that they kind of just had, you know, in the tuck and the stash. So my favorite though on this album is End of Story. Then we have Pharrell. He gave us the piece by piece soundtrack and this soundtrack has 21 songs lasting about an hour and 26 minutes long. Money Man, Zaytoven, and Traumatone work together on TMZ and on this collaboration project, they compiled a total of 17 songs reaching 36 minutes long of listening time. Then we got Gashi with Brooklyn Cowboy and he put 18 songs onto this Brooklyn Cowboy lasting an hour. Then we got one of the greatest artists out there, one of the greatest rappers, Currency, of course, and one of the greatest of producers here, DJ Fresh, publishing the encore. And this piece of work, they put out 11 records lasting a total of 26 minutes long. Listen to that. 11 records, 26 minutes long. That means that we're getting great quality music, long formats, which is amazing that it's come back because sometimes like these quick, you know, minute or two songs kind of gets played out. We want something long. Give us quality, not quantity. All right. Next, we got Glorilla who gave us Glorious. <laughs> Get it? Gloria? Glorilla? Ah, 
Oh man, all right. I'm sorry. Glorilla Glorious. Anywho, uh, after she pulled back her initial release date, whether it was with a single or the album is unclear, she was about to release something and pulled back when she found out that her good friend Rod Wave was releasing something of his own at that point in time. And she basically backed down. So she finally came back here and, well, she gave us Glorious, uh, holding about 15 songs, being 42 minutes long. To piggyback off of that, Rod Wave is back yet again with some music dropping. And they actually dropped at the same time, which if you really think about it, that's actually kind of cool that they just, you know, tag team, you know, one night together. And uh, Rod Wave here dropped his own new album as well called The Last Lap, having 23 songs holding up to an hour and seven minutes long. Woo! What a night of music releases, all right? So thank you for tuning in. If you could like this video, share it with everyone you know. And please subscribe to this YouTube channel. It'll be greatly appreciated. Shout out to Fat Joe. Soy Pancho. Y ya. They've been like lately talking about Latinos, wasn't it rap and this and this. These guys are delusional. We're from the Bronx, New York. It happens. And so when hip hop started, it's Latino and black, half and half. But they going at me because I'm like the only Spanish dude, like really with a big voice. Yeah, and Latinos wasn't there. You was invited. You are a, a specimen. You, I don't know what the is up with these people. They don't know their facts.